Today we have a 2004 Lexus ES330. Uh, this came into the shop here into us after uh, the mechanics replacing the uh, evaporator core for the air conditioner, which means they had to replace the, uh, remove the dash. The problem we had was uh, no audio. And uh, the radio, we probably have the removal guide on our website for that. But the amplifier in this case, this one is specifically called the 6CD type except Mark Levinson without the Lexus navigation system. So what we've done here is we dropped the uh, glove box to get to the amplifier because we tested the radio and the radio tests good. The amplifier we've removed, it sits up here in the corner up next to one of the control pan uh, boxes here and fits up into this slot. There's one screw at the top, a 10 millimeter, and one at the bottom that holds it up in place like this. Now, uh, actually the other way around, but we have two connectors that go into the front of this and uh, we have the main uh, input power along with out to the speakers and the uh, input connector with the uh, communication between the radio and this uh, amplifier control box. Uh, we started opening the wires out till we realized uh, in case you ever have this problem of the dash being taken apart and put back together with no audio, the same connector right up here for the AC controls or next to the fan motor is a small white connector and it just so happens the same connector coming out of the amplifier here that uh, transmits audio and communicates, they're both the same connector and what we found is they had been swapped and we were getting no audio because they said the radio had audio when it came into the shop and no audio when they were done putting the dash back together. Uh, also, uh, to get to this control box, uh, to get the glove box out, we start at the panel in the door jam here and pulled up the back and uh, pulled this back. This is going to give access to one of the screws at the bottom for the bottom of the glove box, the second screw at the bottom for the glove box. Uh, the whole glove box needs to be removed. There's a, a panel down below here that will pop down. Then there are screws along the side of the uh, glove box. You drop the glove box and the whole assembly so you can get to this. Again, the two screws, if you can see them, one goes way up there. It's a 10 millimeter that holds the uh, amplifier in place. And then one down here at the bottom as well, uh, right there. Uh, hope this video has been helpful. Hope you never have this problem. Uh, hope this is a less seen video than most of ours. Please subscribe and thank you for watching.